Hello, today we will discuss about structure. What is structure? A structure is a user defined data type in C or C++. What is structure? It is used to create the record. Let me give the example for the same. For example, I want to create a one structure and the name of the structure is student. It means I want to store the record of the student. We all know each and every student have roll number. So we can say that this is the member of structure. We can say that this structure student is a this is a name of structure. So struct student is a name of structure. Integer roll number is a member of structure. If you are writing here character name of 20, then it also a member of structure. But you can say that this is array within structure. Here you can define the structure variable. For example, if you want to declare the variable of student that is student S1, then S1 is equal to here in curly braces, you can initialize the value of roll number and name. In short, you can create the record roll number 101, for example, and the name is, for example, Devan Patel. Now I want to create one more record. So I'm simply copying this S1 is equal to you can paste over here and you can say this is S2 is equal to 102 and this is the record of for example Tatsat Shukla. Now I want to access this value. So you can say that this S1 is representing the student. So this is the one record of structure that is roll number and name. This is the roll number and name. Now I want to print this. So very simple. You can just simply print percentage minus 5d it means left aligned five digit percentage minus 20 is main 20 character length of name then you can just write over here that is s1 dot roll number s1 dot name you can simply copy this and you can paste and here you can write simply that is a slash n and instead of s1 you can use s2 dot roll number and s2 dot name you can simply run this particular program and you will be able to see that this is the simple structure with the two member one is the roll number and another is the name and for that i created the two variable s1 and s2 s1 is referring to roll number and name both s2 is also referring to roll number and name both this is the very simple demonstration of the structure you can say this is the variable but this is the optional part if you don't want to declare the variable over here then you can declare it in a main also so that particular topic we will discuss into next lecture thank you